Continuing our theme from last week, uh, our next feature is a demo from Karine Kawan in our App of the Week section, who is going to demonstrate CX Explorer. Hello, Blind Android Users podcast listeners. This is Karine Kiwan. I'm going to make a quick demo of the CX File Explorer File Manager application. It's free and um, I will use mainly the swipe method to try to uh, show you the interface elements. And uh, since I'm not an English native speaker, so I'm sorry of if there's any mistake and for anything that is not understandable. Ruthless home screen what turbo CX CX file explorer CX file explorer this more options button I have the more options pop up window settings go from there to settings CX file explorer navigate up button okay, so settings here default apps heading default apps built in apps heading image viewer not ticked video player ticked music player ticked text editor ticked tick box the app contains um uh some players with basic function functionality um, you can play music you can um, play videos uh, you can view images and edit .txt files and uh, they are considered accessible as much as i tested them notification settings heading storage is full show when the storage is over 98 percent full recycle bin settings use recycle bin by default not ticked tick box here, if I'm going to use the recycle bin as the default option when deleting, or I want to delete the files or folders permanently. Show recycle confirmation, ticked, tick box, disable, advanced settings, detect USB connection, ticked, tick box. If the USB connection uh, is detected by the app automatically, so if I'm trying, if I'm connecting a flash memory, for example, using USB on the go, Show system storage, ticked, tick box. If system storage is shown. File size unit, GB. Show advanced menus, heading. Add to home screen, ticked, tick box. Hide, unhide, ticked, tick box. Open as, ticked, tick box. Though uh, the, the, I can here um, specify if I want those options to appear when dealing with the files. So uh, let's, uh, let's say, for example, if I want to have the option to add the file to the home screen. Or not about heading CX file explorer. More options. I'm going back from the settings and main storage. Let's see here 27 percent 35 gigabytes. One images 389 megabytes. Audio 2.6 videos. One point analyze button. Okay, so this information is related to the size used and the main, the main storage. <clears throat> here, I'm not having any uh, memory card inserted in my device. And uh, it's showing me the size used and the uh, percentage used in addition to the, uh, how what's the size taken by each category, like images and videos. One point, analyze button. And I have the analyze button. I'll press on that. Navigate, storage, more option, main storage, 93.18 gigabytes free, 27%. More button. If I press on more, it will show me the folders that are taking the most size and uh, I can deal with them, deal with the files. Large files, 3.08 gigabytes, files larger than 10 megabytes, more button. Okay, if I press more here, it will show me the files that are larger than 10 megabytes and also I can deal with them, like deleting some of them. Cache files, 352 megabytes, cache files, clear button. More button. I can clear from here the cache files directly from the app and I can press on more to see um, the cache size per app basis. So if I want to delete just the cache of a certain application, for example. Currently playing track. Cur okay, going back. Analyze button. Selected. Here I'm having one selected and the other is not selected. The two are not spoken. Um, the first one is is the one that is the, one, the default one actually, and it's the one that's showing me those information. And if I press on the second one, selected, those information will be are going to be replaced by uh, some Main locations storage, download. that I was in. Audio ringtones. Main storage download. So if I press, for example, on 
that down download here it will take me directly to the downloads folder selected selected library and as i said the default one is the first one selected local now the main uh, app app tabs those are local library and network you can find them using explore by touch also uh, they they are in the row which is in the middle of the screen selected local library selected local is selected network, main storage system system partition downloads downloads folder apps recycle bean okay so if i uh, let's uh, go to the main storage and uh, here we will see how files and folders are arranged and this uh, displaying method is used across uh, all the uh, the tabs and pages main storage download see system main storage uh, it's showing me the folders but if i put my finger on the top of the screen Acapella voices six oh, navigate up button. i have those main storage arrow drop down view here i can change some viewing options um cx like file explorer apply to all folders not ticked view heading ticked radio button not ticked but radio unfortunately button. those are not spoken not ticked radio button ticked radio not ticked radio button sort heading here is the sorting name I can others heading select name size and others show hidden file others heading name others heading show hidden files show hidden files not ticked tick box okay if hidden files are shown apply to all folders not ticked tick and box. Uh, if that uh, if if those changes will be applied into all folders or not going back CX file explore more options button here i can search i can create a new folder i can refresh home. and i have the home that will take me to the home page root analyze acapella voices six items so toggle selection uh, alarms 50 toggle selection when i'm swiping next to each folder and next to each file i will have the toggle selection um some some people may prefer dealing with things using the explore by touch they may consider it easier gm font down dot east backups dot down font gm lazy list zero items and uh android for toggle selection some people also may prefer uh, to not have those toggle selection uh, next to each file and folder they they prefer to just long press and have uh the selection mode uh, and and to uh, just long press to to enter the selection mode this is not the case here android for toggle selection if i select selected. this folder currently playing track current or lazy list zero items. nearly at the bottom of the screen bottom menu say fairy copy move, move copy i'm having this those options move rename delete more so if i press on delete for delete. example delete preparing to delete files folder 507 ticked permanently delete tick box if i press here it will permanently delete the files or folders and if uh, if it's uh, checked if it's not checked it will just take them to the recycle bin cancel button I'm canceling here cx dcim three top documents to i top download a phoebe mp3 4.74 megabytes if I press on that mp3 currently play track pause button, play at the bottom of the screen it's showing me uh, that it's this track is currently playing it's playing in the uh, built-in music player play or play button currently playing track currently if i press on that a zero three one percent four oh six i can deal with the seek bar i can shuffle button skip to previous play skip button. to previous skip to next see it on google Go android back. Back. toggle selection one selected copy selecting one and it will sell, tell me that this item is selected but in other areas like in the apps manager and in the new file section and the, if, if the item is selected or not that will not be told copy but here it's ch to let us toggle two selected toggles selected item ch to let currently playing track so more bottom menu save more see more pop up window share share compress compressed to dot zip properties and the properties 
Now I'll go back. CH to let escape launches. Toggle selection. If I select one item, I can find one more. One selected. Play or pause button more. Things like. Pop up wind. Compress. Open with. Open as. Open with. Open as. Properties. And. Open. open compress. Add to home screen. Well, add to home screen. CX file explorer. More. Well. Ophelia MP3. 4.74 megabytes. Now or. Toggle selection. Two selected. Just. Copy. Copy something. Cancel. I will have also at the bottom bottom part. Paste layer. Cancel. Paste. The cancel and paste. Showing up main storage. Navigate up. Main more options. Home. Going to the home page. Audio ringtones. Apps. Now let's see the library. Download. Sorry, the apps. Apps section. Downloaded. Wrong when or selected. Downloaded. Downloaded and all, which will include system apps. Or wrong when voice. Toggle selection. Selecting one. Toggle. Wrong when voice. English GB. Twenty point five five. Toggle selected. selection. But it's selected. Backup. I'm seeing at the bottom of the screen the backup. Uninstall. The uninstall. Share. Share. Open. And open. Store. And to go to its page in the Play Store. Going back. AC Bridge. Zero point. See audio ringtones library. I'll see the library section now. Library. Network images. It will categorize things or files due to if if they if they are images or audio or audio. Let's see the audio. New pipe one. Okay, it's showing me the folder and the number of file audio files contained in it. So if I uh, enter it, I can view them and also delete CX them. CX file exp audio ringtone selected local and new files. I have the new files section. Doc videos doc new files, which is something I I think it's very important in the file manager. It will show you the recently added files, so sometimes it will save you a lot of the time. Document, new files. You may lose while you are searching for a file. Document, new file. Recently added file. The demo MP3 demo, the 22nd of March 2021, 2021 03 22 14. Toggle selection. Demo to MP, toggle selection. One selected. Toggle, demo to okay, MP. So I can select and do the usual stuff here. Demo MP3. Going CX back. File selected library network. The network. third selected one. page three of three audio ringtones document library selected network access from network access from network here I can access the files on the phone using the uh, computer. And the easiest way is to use um, is to just enter a, a folder on your computer and then press the F4 delete the path and uh, enter the FTP link and then you have to enter the username and password and you can deal with the files and folders cut copy add and delete and all of that stuff select access from the that. options here navigate access from scan not ticked or not ticked random password tick box the password is generated random randomly by the app port and here the port 3904 edit can box edit it. password the password 111001 Ticked. Show hidden files. And Tick box. Hidden files are shown. Start the service to access. Start and service. To start button. the service. Back. Access from network. New location. Paste new layout. New location. New location. Cloud. Remote. Selected. I have cloud. cloud and remote. Remote. Dropbox. Cloud. I have some cloud services like Google Drive. One Drive. Box. Those are the services. And uh, the remote. One drop. I Google. have. Drop. Remote. Remote. Local network, SMB, FTP, SFTP, WebDAV. Okay, so this is my demo of the CX File Explorer. I hope that it was clear and that it's uh, useful. And uh, thank you for listening. Amazing. I'll definitely be trying this. It's actually a good um, file manager. I have that as one of my uh, file managers. And... There are certain things it does that other explorers or other file managers don't do, but it's absolutely a nice file manager. If you don't want to use others, that could be a go-to file manager. Yeah, definitely. And hopefully between last week's show and this, we've given you a, a fleet of file manager apps to explore and have a look at, and you'll find something that suits your individual needs and tastes.